Hey everyone, this is Gleb Bakhmadov and I want to show how I scaffold new Cypress projects. Let's take a folder where is nothing and let's start new npm package. Okay, first thing first, we need to install Cypress. So I will do npm install dev dependency Cypress. So this downloads the binary or uses the cached version binary. The first time I run Cypress, using Cypress open, it will look around and it will scaffold a new project. As you can see, it created a whole bunch of example specs so that I can run them right away and kind of learn what Cypress can do and how it does it and how the test runner works. So this scaffolds a kitchen sink project. So that's great. If I close Cypress, I can see the files that it created. It created Cypress JSON which is an empty JSON file. And it creates a folder with pictures, plugins, and support. So I don't want to scaffold these files every time. For example, once I look at the kitchen sink once, I don't want to scaffold it again and again. So to scaffold Cypress projects easier and without all the kitchen sink files, I created a tiny utility called Bakhmutov CLI. Almost sounds like Cypress command line. So how do we use it? Let's do the same thing. I'll create a new folder. I'll initialize a, an empty package JSON. I'll have to install Cypress. That first requirement. But now that Cypress is installed, I can use npx utility to in, use a package called Bakhmutov CLI without installing it as a dependency. And I can just say init. Great. So it has done something. If we look at our folder, we can see again a Cypress JSON file, which is empty, and we can see Cypress folder has fixtures integration, but also has README. So let me open this folder in my VS Code. Let's look at the scaffolded README. So this actually explains what the folder contains. So that anyone who has never seen Cypress can understand what this folder is for and especially what its subfolders are for. So there are fixtures, integration and plugins. Notice the integration only has an example Cypress test and not the whole kitchen sink. So this was CLI init. You can also scaffold a TypeScript project and my favorite, a bear project. Let me show you the bear project. I'll make another folder initialize empty package, install Cypress. But now instead of just doing init, I'll specify an option bare and look what it has scaffolded. The Cypress JSON file will say fixtures. I don't have any fixtures, no support file, no plugins. And inside the Cypress, you only have integration subfolder with a single bare bones test. Now I'm ready to write test and I don't need to bring or worry about support, fixtures, all the files that I don't need. 